Well, if someone offered you $10,000, what would you do? When Ruth Eckert Hall was offered $10,000 for, uh, for a concert, a benefit concert, everything seemed like a very good idea. But then came the complaints because of the involvement of one controversial group. As Fox 13's Peter Linton Smith reports tonight, the money would have been used to help rebuild a classic old theater in Clearwater. For Ruth Eckert Hall, it was a deal they couldn't refuse. David Pomerantz wanted to do something good for the community. He's a fabulous performer. The concert was set, but there was one other group that wanted to get involved. Church of Scientology thought it would be good for the Capitol Theater. It didn't seem like much of an issue that the Church of Scientology was interested, but when the announcement went out, Ruth Eckert Hall was deluged with angry emails. Well, I, I, I didn't expect the level of emails that we got. That benefit concert could have been lucrative for Ruth Eckert Hall. Estimates were they could have made up to $10,000. But since some of that money was going to come from here, the Church of Scientology, Ruth Eckert decided to say thanks, but no thanks. The Church of Scientology is controversial, but let's face it, $10,000 is a lot of money, especially to turn down. What if the money came from the Church of Scientology? Probably not. If it was freely, sure, why not? Why are they giving you the money? The Church of Scientology issued a written statement saying the planned fundraiser is but one of many contributions the church makes to make Clearwater a better place to live. But Ruth Eckert Hall says the contribution is one they cannot accept. Some donors felt that they wanted to, uh, you know, pull back on some contributions. In Clearwater, Peter Linton Smith, Fox 13 News. The money, by the way, would have gone to the Capitol Theater. The old Capitol Theater, which is now being operated and managed by Ruth Eckert Hall, that's trying to turn this classic old place into a modern show place. Scientology says they're going to look for other ways to support this theater, which is around the corner from their headquarters in Clearwater.